In 10% Human, How Your Body's Microbes Hold the Key to Health and Happiness, Alana Collin highlights the complex and fascinating world of the microbiome. Through the lens of microbiology and immunology, Colin presents compelling evidence of the vast importance of the trillions of microorganisms that live within and on our bodies. From digestion to immunity, the role of the microbiome in shaping our health is crucial. One of the key takeaways from Colin's work is the individualized nature of our microbiome. While we all share this collection of bacteria, viruses, fungi, and other microorganisms, our unique genetic makeup, diet, lifestyle, and environment influence its composition. The impact of antibiotics on the microbiome is another critical theme in 10% human. While antibiotics are undoubtedly life-saving drugs, they can also have unintended consequences. By wiping out both harmful and beneficial bacteria, excessive use of antibiotics can lead to long-term health issues, including obesity, allergies, and autoimmune disorders. Diet is also a significant factor in maintaining a healthy microbiome. Eating a diverse array of plant-based and fermented foods can promote the growth of beneficial microbes. In contrast, a diet high in sugar and processed foods can be harmful to our microbiome. Perhaps the most surprising finding of Colin's work is the link between our microbiome and our mood and behavior. Emerging research suggests that our gut microbes play a role in regulating anxiety, depression, and even social behavior. This revelation could lead to groundbreaking new treatments for mental health conditions. While the idea of nurturing our microbiome is relatively new, researchers have already begun exploring the potential of microbiome-based therapies for treating a range of conditions. From inflammatory bowel disease to cancer, the microbiome may hold the key to new, more effective treatments. By studying the unique microbiome of individual patients, doctors can develop targeted therapies that may be more effective than traditional treatments. As research in this field continues to grow, it's clear that the microbiome represents a new frontier in medicine, with the potential to revolutionize the way we think about health and wellness. Colin argues that we need to take care of our microbiome, if we want to promote overall health and well-being. This includes avoiding unnecessary antibiotics, eating a healthy diet, and reducing our exposure to environmental toxins that can harm our microbiome. By recognizing the importance of our microbiome and taking steps to protect it, we can improve our chances of living long, healthy lives. If you enjoyed this review and would like to purchase the book, support the channel by clicking the affiliate link in the description below. Don't forget to like and subscribe.